the Chinese electric vehicle company BYD, acronym for Build Your Dream, known as New Energy Vehicles in China, has officially surpassed Elon Musk's Tesla. In China, there's a proverb advising against mocking a Chinese person, as they tend to transform misfortunes into triumphs. In 2011, Elon Musk mocked the Chinese BYD electric cars, stating, Have you seen their cars? They have to make sure they don't die in China first, before the dream of competing with Tesla. Although there's competitors now ramping up, and yeah. as you're familiar with BYD, which is also on the West Coast, I think they're ramping up production of their electric vehicles. <laughs> uh, Warren Buffett owns 10% stake in that. Uh, why do you laugh? BYD <laughs> is trying to compete. Why do you laugh? Have you seen their car? Well, they are on a different. They are on a different. <laughs> tell me why Sorry. you're laughing. Um, you don't see them at all as a competitor. No. Why is that? I mean, they offer a lower price point. I, I don't. Th I don't think they have a great product. Why is that? Um, I, I don't think it's, it's particularly attractive. The technology is, is not very strong, um, and, and BYD as a company has pretty severe problems in their home turf in China. BYD currently holds the leading position in the electric vehicle market. BYD vehicles are priced lower than Teslas and come in hybrid versions in addition to battery-only powered cars. Right now, the European Union is deeply concerned about China's rapid development as it poses a significant challenge to their ability to compete in the automotive industry. We have witnessed this problem in the past with the rise of Chinese Huawei technologies. What the United States has implemented is a ban on all Huawei cell phones and also chip sales to Huawei under the Espionage Act. Huawei recently announced that it has regained momentum, with its revenue approaching the $100 billion mark for the year, despite ongoing U.S. sanctions targeting the Chinese smartphone manufacturer. It's important to recognize that the key to the U.S.'s global dominance lies not in its capacity to cultivate domestic talent, but rather in the efficacy of the H-1B visa program. Basically, the H-1B is a special visa in the United States that allows U.S. employers to employ foreign geniuses in specialty occupations. A pivotal factor contributing to the success of BYD EVs is their blade battery technology, coupled with their competitive pricing strategy. The Chinese miracle extends beyond electric vehicles into the aviation industry. No longer reliant on Boeing parts, China has initiated the development of its own aircraft. The C-91-Teen's arrival means that Chinese airlines will have a locally produced alternative to Airbus or Boeing. Chinese companies are manufacturing their own parts rather than relying on imports. Tesla, on the other hand, is now concerned about losing its Chinese cars market. We are personally opting for the Chinese models because they're cost-effective, efficient, and have a futuristic appearance. As China undergoes rapid development, the U.S. and the European Union are increasingly imposing additional trade sanctions to undermine its economy. BYD is making significant progress, expanding its presence in the U.S., South Korea, and Germany. Additionally, the Chinese automotive sector is fiercely challenging Japan for supremacy on the global stage. It appears that no measure, such as barring access to the International Space Station, or restricting access to GPS and chip technology can impede Chinese advancement. They persist in forging their own path. Meet NIO, a Chinese rival of Tesla. Their cars stand out for their exceptional design and innovative features. Here's a brief introduction to something you might not have come across before. The Chinese luxury car maker NIO is the only major operator of automobile battery swapping stations for the public. The company has built around 2,250 battery swap stations around China and Europe, and the process takes only three minutes from start to finish. NIO vehicles are also known for their impressive acceleration and overall performance. Electric motors deliver instant torque and quick acceleration compared to traditional combustion engine vehicles. Despite experiencing a net loss of $639 million, 
the car manufacturer headquartered in Shanghai vows to implement further cost-cutting measures to remain competitive in China's fiercely competitive market. China's state-led initiatives, investment strategies, and technological advancements are invaluable lessons for developing nations looking to achieve similar progress in areas such as industrialization, poverty reduction, and innovation. Mm -hmm.